It's Go Go Media Girl, and I'm uh, at SD. SDC. SDC with. Melissa. And. Tandy. Okay. And so, what do you guys do? Um, so, basically, we started our brand like a couple of months back. It's called S2C Fashion High, and we're just going into the fashion industry, designing our clothing, making them ourselves, including the jewelry as well. So, we're just exploring a bit, uh, we're just exploring the industry and seeing where our niche market is and targeting a certain kind of girl that dresses a certain kind of way and that doesn't mind exploring into fashion, prints, and just uh, like the crop top textures as well. So that's our passion. Anything you want to add? Um, yeah, basically to add on what she said, we are, our market is basically between 25 and 35. But if you still have that body, when you're over 35, then you can still wear what we have. Um, we more of uh, elegant. You can go partying. It's it's a very it's it's a mix of things, mix of colors, mix of textures, mix of fabrics. Very important. So yeah, basically that's yeah that's quite it. Um. So what skills do you need when you're making the clothes and jewelry and everything? Yeah. Um, what skills? You don't really need skills if you have a passion for it. Um, it's something that you can look into and an eye for it. So maybe like if you go into pattern making, because that's very important when it comes to clothing, the fit needs to be, needs to make that person look better or make that person's body look way more appealing than what they feel is comfortable for them. But what we do, especially for those people that don't mind exploring their body and dressing in a crop top or a high waist skirt and we go very vintage we like the vintage look so that's our, that's what we're going for now yeah yes basically vintage with color yeah you know a whole lot of color yeah because you know how high waisted and um, crop tops are so old school so in that way in in that way being vintage so we want to bring that all back it, it, I don't know why it, it, it left it needs to come back <laughs> thank you. Um, so what skill, I mean, uh, what tips would you give somebody who wants to be a fashion designer or go into the jewelry making business? First and foremost, it's a lot of work, so you need to be a hands-on person. You can't just um, have ideas and not push them through and not make sure that they get to the people or your target market. So that's the main thing I'd give people, hard work and no sleep and just a whole lot of passion a whole lot of yeah. you sleep you lose money no sleep <laughs> no sleep at all it requires a lot of patience and you need to be passionate and if you're passionate you won't see how hard work it is because it'll just be something you love doing and it'll flow so yeah basically yes you basically do it in your sleep <laughs> well that was um palissa palissa and tandy and go go media girl